Hello, welcome back. It has been a while, um, almost a year now, but we're back. I'm gonna try and start uploading more consistently now, um, especially since I now have an entire room set up just for this. Um, today we're going to be exploring a new horror game. It's just the demo, Nine Child Street. Um, it says in the description that uh, you play as a child who began to notice strange things in an abandoned house opposite in which an old toy creator lived, and somehow at night, secretly from his parents, talking on, taking only a flashlight, he decided to see what was happening in the house. But as it should be in a horror, it turns out that this place is fraught with a terrible secret. So. I have not seen any gameplay for this, um, I didn't even watch the whole demo video that they have on um, the site. We are just going to get into this. Um, let's get started. I'm probably going to jump a lot because you guys know from watching my streams that the slightest jump scares make me overreact. Um, well, let's just give it a try. Armin, the protagonist of our story, was a very curious boy. He is about to turn nine years old. After his birthday, he began to notice strange things happening in the abandoned house across the street. One night, when he saw the light in the window, he finally decided to go to this mysterious house. Oh, the atmosphere is already there. This looks... Oh, we're right in. Oh, oh, I do not like that I can't see hardly anything in front of me. Get into the house. Can I... Oh my gosh, we're so small. Oh, this is gonna be scary. I can tell you now, I don't like the sounds going on right now. Apparently we can't go through the front door. And we cannot open the windows. Who abandons a house and leaves all the windows locked? <laughs> Who took the time? Ooh, gosh. I think the full version of this game is probably going to be absolutely terrifying. Let's kind of just look around a bit. It's really pretty. Um, the noise is so, okay, um, creepy playground, maybe, is that like a slide, yeah it is, oh my goodness, oh, more creepy playground equipment, glad we decided to look around. read the controls. How am I supposed to climb up? Let me find out real quick. Oh, doesn't um doesn't say. We do not want to be turning the flashlight off. No, thank you. I think that's... Mm. Just opening and closing the window. I 
Examine the room with the light on the second floor. What if, um, I don't want to do that. Can we open anything yet? Oh, that's nice. Uh, that's real nice. I don't like dolls. I should have known this game was going to be scary because I'm already scared of dolls. Oh, we can open some cabinets. This is just too much. Wait, um, I don't see like an option to hide or anything, so hopefully that's not a mechanic in this. So we can open a lot of stuff. But the drawers are just kind of empty. I don't know if that's on purpose or if it's just because it's just the demo. Um, let's keep exploring. Creepy. Um, we are so short. Someone absolutely not. Um, <laughs> oh, that's nice. Thanks. Um, I have a light already though, so, um, what nine-year-old kid does this? Oh my god, absolutely not. Hello Jack, I'm a longtime fan of yours and I really love your work. I would like to get an exclusive doll, please answer. Okay, um, we're not going to explore that just yet. Just in case there's more stuff to be found down here. Oh, no, Why? that is just unnecessary to make it sound that creepy. We have more stairs over here. This is a big house. Oh no. Why? There's just some real un- What? It seems like my flashlight is getting ready to go out. Can we not do that? Oh, great. This is... Um... Well, that just happened. Okay, I think it's time. Um, creepy. We can't keep avoiding going up the stairs. Oh my gosh. Why? See, it, who, whatever it is doesn't want visitors. Like, I don't feel like we should be disturbing it. This is, oh, absolutely, absolutely not. No, oh, we, we can't leave. Um, what? 
Why, why can I not leave now? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Can this kid not run? Um, I'm pretty sure those weren't blocked before. I always knew that children attracted me. They carry good in them, in my house, and in me. This good has always been absent. Now in my house. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, 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 no. Why can I not run? It seems, oh God. I do not like how quiet it just got. It is. I don't want to do this anymore. Goodness, I'm sorry I got quiet. This just suddenly got really scary. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. <laughs> um, there's like gotta be a key somewhere, right? Gosh, the crying is so loud. I don't know if I have this loud enough for you guys, but you should definitely be wearing headphones because it, it sounds super, super loud. Oh 
mean, I found the source of the crying and it didn't give me an updated objective, so I'm guessing I have to find a key or something to get into that room. Um, what? I just, I'm, I'm gonna leave now. Why does that keep happening? I'm supposed to be avoiding that ghost. Maybe I'm supposed to turn the light off. Because he is definitely there. to like chill out I don't know am I supposed to go to it or <sighs> okay let's see cuz last time it just like okay now it's just gone I was gonna say last time it just charged us and then disappeared I don't know if you can die in this game or if it's just supposed to spook you a lot. I feel like I'm supposed to be in this room because this is where he was at. I already read that note on the table. She turned nine. I built her a slide in the backyard. Steve is my new nine-year-old friend. In honor of this, I built a swing. Andrews, did this guy murder children? Or did he just... Summon ghosts. really liking the atmosphere here. This is going to be a very scary game at full release. Like, I'm pretty easy to scare I guess, but I'm pretty, I'm pretty terrified right now. I feel like I've been through this whole... house now and haven't oh no 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 
What is what is that? definitely murdered children because there was the coffin in the room it had our name in it so I think you could definitely die in this game Maybe now that I've seen him, the door will be open for like the crying. like a certain area it wants me to go because it's blocked off the stairs. Oh god, this is creepy. Every time I come in this room, the light blinks, and it makes me feel like, oh god, oh no, 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 no. Why did it have to be the bathroom? No, I don't like that I can do that. I don't like that I can do that at all. Just the atmospheric sounds are so loud. It still won't let me go up the stairs.
everything sounds really loud in here, but I still can't figure out what it is exactly that I'm... Um... Okay... Okay, well that took me way too long to figure out. Ugh. I'm going to die soon. It doesn't really make me sad. I want to do the last job. Connect the children so that they live peacefully. doll is still there. Thank God it hasn't moved yet. Um, I'm going to try and leave now because maybe that's what the key is for. Can I not use the key there? That objective he is. Oh, the doors. Why do they sound like that?
It's it's way too quiet. It's way too fucking quiet. I know it wants us to follow these, but I really don't want to. I really, really don't want to. Of course there's a basement. Okay, well, I guess that's the demo. Let's just see what this, uh, what this shows. Yeah, so that's it. Um, that was very, very scary. Uh, I cannot wait for this full game to release because I think it's going to be absolutely terrifying just that short demo like the sounds in their cells are so scary that you're just like on edge the whole time and then the creepy dolls the creepy dolls add to it of course uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in the next one